Hey guys, welcome back to this video. In this video, this is part 7 of the series of how I make a jailbreak game. Um, we're gonna actually start off already with building, because if we build, we can uh, script, because I have some very cool theories in mind. Um, let's begin uh, building, and um, let's go. On this uh, what we're gonna do uh, you, you're gonna scroll all the way up and you're gonna uh, right click insert object and you're gonna click on folder here it is and you're gonna call it color neon parts and um, you need to color every part like this one's gonna be green and name it color part one and then this one is going to be uh, let's do uh, yellow well no not yellow because that looks a bit odd let's do this one color part two and this one is going to be like this color part three and you're gonna do this for every part let's speed it up everything I think so now you gotta hold click one of the parts and then go all the way up and put them in here let's see if we got every part no we missed one that is not a problem just gotta So in Jailbreak, you can actually emo, but I'm going to disable them. It's optional, but I'm just disabling them uh, due to game breaking and stuff maybe in the future. Uh, if you want it, go to Start a GUI, insert a local script, and type game start GUI, calling set core GUI enabled, enum.core GUI type, emotes false. And if you want to figure out more, we can do Start a GUI, set core GUI enabled, enum.core. And here you can see everything. So. For example, if we do all, comma false, uh, it's gonna literally disable everything. We're gonna see. Here we are. No chat. No health. No player GUI. No. Oh, okay. Resetting is true. 
Whoopsie, you just died. Which is still a good thing. Uh, I'm gonna get just get rid of this second line. Alright, uh, let's call it a uh, core UI handler. Um, do it to Roblox. There's now this uh, um, a top bar gone. So, uh, what you want to do is you're gonna go into your death frame GUI, go to your frame, and let's use our background color three, paste it in border color, and set the border size pixel to maximum. So I'm just gonna do, yeah, hundred is the max. So if we try it out now, play. Here we are. If we die, you should see the top bar should be. Yeah, the top bar is also covered, which is amazing. This concludes our tutorial for today. I hope you enjoyed this. If you want something for me to make in this game, make sure to let me know down in the comments below so I can do exactly what you want. I'll see you in the next episode, part eight. See ya on my bye.